Hey everyone, it's Martin here, one hour playthrough. Welcome back to the long dark. Let's continue. Ooh, the fire just died down. It's early in the morning. I'm fat, I'm rested, I'm everything. Got some bonuses going. And we have to get the mats back to the trapper. Uh, so let's get right to it. Shouldn't be uh, too long of a walk, but... Uh, it was too long for the last episode, so uh, yeah, let's continue this story and see where it brings us. And I wonder about that bear, if we're going to come across it, probably later, no doubt. But if so, I really need that gun, so hopefully I can get that. Let's get a move on, do a bit of a running. And I think we're about... Let's see here right now. If I go in diagonal, it should be fine. That direction. And eventually bump into the house. At least I hope. <laughs> Alright, how's my gun doing? Is it reloaded? It is reloaded. Good stuff. Alright. That's a good thing. Let's pick up some sticks. I repaired all my clothing as well. I should be really good to go right now. Few more sticks, maybe. There you go. All right, let's do a little bit of a run. Downhills goes faster, so that's pretty good. All right, is this this lake where I found this dead dude? I think it is. All right, I probably is a little bit in the back here. Let's see, can I estimate where I am? I'm going to guess I'm about here. No, I think I'm going to continue running this way. Probably just easier for now to find home. Oh, maybe my, um, my rabbit, my bunny trap. Maybe I've got something, who knows. Yeah, so there's the train from last time. So it's just right over this hill, basically. Just go around it a little bit. I think it's a lit, little bit less steeper. Alright, I think that's enough sticks for now. Do I have a torch? Actually, I don't. Might be handy to have one with me. Awesome. Maybe some bir birch bark. Yeah. I need to check about the percentage, how good the tinder it is, but I think it should be okay. And let's see if we can climb up here. Is this too steep? Uh, I barely can do it. <laughs> but that's enough. And then behind here we should see the house somewhere. Oh, there's the bunny. So here should be the trap as well. One more little hill. Alright, so... Didn't caught anything here. Maybe I should place it somewhere else. Let's try this. Let's put it over here. I saw them last time running here as well, so like that. Need to check if I carry guts with me actually. No, no decoys, so that's pretty easy to know. Alright. Alright, so Oh there it is, yeah, there's the little house. Great. Plenty of time to do another mission, whatever it is. Alright, let's make a run.
think I have some cloth I need to dump here. Took that with me after the repairs. We have food here as well. I have some food. All right, well that's good. All right, let's put this over here. Transfer all and transfer these. And put. T t yeah, this should be fine. Can always find cloth on my way. All right, let's go inside. Hey, old guy. Hey. Hey, you still with me? Shit. I'm too late. <laughs> oh my goodness. your name <coughs> call me Jeremiah I went to the dam found some supplies that should help oh thanks because my insides hurt like hell <sighs> what did you find general meds painkillers antibiotics and what looks to be some old vials of morphine. <laughs> morphine? Easy. Hopefully your pain won't get that bad. You alone out here? <sighs> What's it to you? What the hell are you doing out here anyway? Hey, don't get excited. I'm just looking for someone. The only thing you should be looking for is a way to kill that bear. Bear? Uh, yeah. He'll be back soon enough. And when he is, I'll be ready. <coughs> Shit. Ready for what? You can barely sit up. Uh, that bear is a man killer. If we don't finish him off, no telling what savage fury he'll unleash. We? I, I'm just on my way through the area. That bear's got nothing to do with me. <laughs> Listen, stranger. You aren't going anywhere. Like it or not, you and me have a problem in common. Neither of us is going to survive. Unless we kill that damn bear. Damn. All right. Let's um. Let's talk about this bear then. What's the story about this bear? The story is real simple. The bear and me, we have unfinished business. Unfinished business? Yeah, you could call it a trading kind. Every time we meet, <laughs> we each leave with a little of each other's blood. Sounds like a losing proposition. I'm sure it will be for one of us. Alright. Um, pain? How's your pain? <laughs> Everything hurts like hell, but I'm alive. Yeah, you want some stronger painkillers? No, I, yeah, I do. But I'll be okay. You seem pretty excited when I mentioned morphine. Morphine? Nah. That stuff's dangerous, especially the old stuff. Addictive. Makes you feel like you're losing, you're floating in a dream. Right. Alright, let's talk about the area. Can you tell me something about uh, the area around us? This whole area takes the name of Mystery Lake nearby. Not much here. Some old cabins here and there. Railway passed through campground around the lakes, closed in the season. Most dead. Mostly dead most of the season. Of the year? Season? <laughs> You're alone out here? <laughs> Pretty much. Whole island mostly abandoned now. Few scattered groups left. No real industry. Uh, rare, uh, rare supply boat from the mainland. That's really the only lifeline for the few few folks that live here in the Great Bear. Sounds like a pretty quiet place. Just the way we like it. We? You're from the mainland. You wouldn't understand. Alright, well, rude. 
Damn, alone, Finch. I think we're done for now. You see those lights in the sky a few nights ago? Yeah. I saw them. We see the northern lights this far up, but... I've never seen anything quite like that. I'm a bush pilot. Those lights took my plane down. Nearly died in the crash. Now I need to find my... I had a passenger with me. Dead? I sure hope not. We were on our way to Perseverance Mills. You know it? Shit, nothing town. A few hours north. Sounds about right. Yeah, I know it. You're the first person I've seen in months. I haven't seen your friend. The phone lines are down. Nothing electrical seems to be working. You think it has something to do with the flash of light? Uh, could be. Wildlife's been acting weird, too. Wolves, mostly. Hanging around more than usual. Like they're waiting. Waiting? For what? I don't know. But I have a bad feeling about it. Look, maybe we can help each other. I don't know. I need to get out there and look for my friend. Well, I have an idea that might help you find who you're looking for. But with that bear out there and me laid up in here, well, you're as good as dead. Thanks for the vote of confidence. What do you have in mind? Well, with that bear on the prowl, You'll never survive long enough to find your friend. And I can't do shit from in here. But I can guide you. You do what I say, and I'll keep you alive. And what's in it for you? Uh, we'll talk about that. But first, you need some protection. Oh, there we go. Hamming my rifle. Oh, yes. Uh oh. What I was afraid of. That shot you took hurt the rifle more than the bear. My rifle's done. Well, shit. shit. <laughs> Sorry. You have a backup? No. No backup. But I know where you might be able to fix it. Great. Where? Old railway yard. About a day's travel south. Along the tracks. Uh there's a machine shop there. I used to trade for time on the tools to keep my gear in order. Bush pilot like you should be able to handle them. I'll see what I can do. Listen. Stay along the tracks. Keep your eyes open for the old bear. If you see him, hide. And pray he doesn't pick up your scent. Don't get cocky. Or we'll both end up dead. Got it. Good luck, pilot. Maybe we'll make a survivor out of you yet. Alright. So, a day's travel. Right? Let me see. Uh, go over my provisions here for a second. I've hardly any food. Should be fine with drink, though. Um, yeah, let's get out. Go outside. I can't take his firewood. Right, so, and we have, of course, a new case. Quest, find the railway maintenance yard and get into the repair shed. Oh, well, let's get right to it. See if we can make it in this episode. All right, I need some food. Let's see. Uh, I might as well take everything I have here. And is there anything else that I need? Might, maybe coal would be good. Um, it's heavy though, and this is heavy as well. Oh, the clicks are not working. What's this? Oh, is that buggy? Oh, there we go. Um, they're really heavy, so let's take one of these and one of these just to just in case I need some quick heat. And the calls, of course, takes a little bit of time. All right, so we have to go back to 
to the railway. That is this way. Let's get right to it. Have some time, not a lot of time. Maybe drink and get some little bit of energy just using the drinks. Alright, that should keep me going for a little bit. There we go. Oh, and last time, uh, in the uh, last episode, I was a little bit silly wondering how many shells I have, but it's at the left top. I have nine left and one is loaded. So I'm pretty good on that part, luckily. I'm trying to balance it out a little bit by using the gun or um, just using a torch if I can. Well, there's a wolf, so that's another balance. Just go around it. There's no wolf down here. No, there's nothing. Good. So I'm going to guess if I go into the tunnel. Please, it's it's there where I think it is, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah I thought so. But this time we are allowed to go in. I was hoping it was this side and not the other side by the dam because that's a really long walk. And I already said it's a day travel, so. And he said that we have to stay on the tracks, this, else we might encounter the bear. So there's that possibility, which I'm not really looking forward to. And also, do I have that gun now with me? No, I don't. Probably it's uh, a quest item, I go to guess right now. Let's gain some energy before I start running again. The eye is already half, so... Does it make a difference if I, if I walk on a little bit more of a flat area? Now it's still two arrows. Alright. Because that is a little bit of a thing. You can drink some coffee and it gives you a little bit back of energy. But not that much. All right, let's go. Do a little bit of a run and when probably just make it before it gets dark. And then uh, we can have a good sleep, make a cup of tea. And revive ourselves a little bit. All right, there we go. Yeah. Okay. Forlorn musket. Muskek. Oh. oh, so we have to go this way, I guess. So we're probably all the way over here. And now I understand, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I understand it's a day's travel because that's a long ass way. All right, let's do it. Let's not waste any more time. Probably around two o'clock now. It's a little bit careful that I don't start running and run into wolves. That will be not the best. Alright, we stay on the tracks. We're going to follow his advice. And um, I didn't see anything else on the map, so... Not sure if there's any other point of interest nearby. Hopefully you can make it to the other side before it gets dark. Oh, I'm... Oh. Right, two wolves. And they are right in my way. They're right in my path. Hopefully I scared the other one. Oh, no. Reload. Yeah, the other one scared as well. Alright, can I run? Let's hide this. I can see broken down train. Oh, Alright, getting tired as well. Right, that wolf is pretty far away, so that's good. I was just talking, wanted to start talking about maybe picking up some cattail along the road. Because my food supply is... It's not so much. Got some, I think got some peanut butter with me, which is pretty good. Alright, I hope... Maybe we have to stay the night here. I'm not sure. 
Let's see what this has to offer. Oh, there's some coal. That's pretty good. Let's scout around this train. There's some cattail over there. Stones. Don't need that. Some extra sticks. Oh, oh. yeah, we can go over here. Oh, is that... Oh. oh, I see. Oh, this is pretty good. There's more coal. Could end up being useful. Tearing it apart. Yeah. Oh, yes. All right, I got another shell. So I got my shell back that I just used. That's pretty, pretty nice. All right, let's look around more. Firewood. All right. Well, I think the game is hinting me. What's this? There's some food. Okay. Damn. This will come handy. Use that to make cloth. More coal. Right. This is pretty damn good. Oh, there's another backpack. Nothing, unfortunately. This pack is getting kind of heavy. Yeah, it's probably the coal waiting me down. Um, where was this? Right over here. Yes. I think I'm going to get a fire going. Sounds good. What's that? Uh, there's nothing. All right, this is completely set up. To spend the night. Let's make a fire. Let's use some accelerant. Looks like it worked. Scrap metal? Okay. Let's put in some reclaimed wood first. Not sure how long a fire I can make, but um let's make tea. Cats are breaking down <laughs> my house. <laughs> That's what you hear on the background. Some tomato soup, that would be nice. I'm not sure how much time I get from one coal. I wonder about that. Alright, um, let's eat. Let's eat you. 300 calories. Right, and we're warming up, so that's a good thing. So it's still afternoon. Um, not sure how long the tea will last me. But I think I will call it an episode right now. Um, how much... Okay, let's do a quick save of the game. Just sleep one hour. Alright, awesome. Let's put some coal on. Let's see how much I get. So I have 1 hour 48. Ooh, uh, it's just, it's an hour. And the cider wood gives me 4 hours, 5, 6, maybe 8 hours of warmth if I need to. I think I will just keep it for um, the morning. But uh, yeah, let's call it an episode. Thank you very much for watching everyone. Thank you for all your support. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. Thank you for uh, supporting me by subscribing and uh, yeah if you haven't subscribed and you like what you see if you subscribe you get a notification when i upload the video which is regular and try it actually daily but i'm uh, have a i have holiday so i have some time to record but um yeah we'll see i'll try to uh, upload daily and get this episode or this chapter out of the way uh, before chapter three starts not sure when till then thanks for watching i'll see you next time have a great day Bye.